So I'm Shiki, um, I'm doing my Masters of Sport Science and we are here at the Bond Institute of Health and Sport. With the Masters, and what's great about it is that you get a lot more hands-on, you get like two semesters worth of um, placement, which is a lot of time compared to you know what we did in undergrad. And um, with that comes you know a lot more responsibility um, that you have to take on. They jump straight in, start coaching from day one. I don't see the benefit in getting an intern to clean your machines. So right from day one, they've been able to coach. My placement supervisor gave me um, full control of um, the athletes that I was taking. Really, really fortunate and thankful to um, Bond to have the opportunity with the AIS and working with um, Glenn Workman with the Head of Strength and Conditioning. He was a really great person to learn from. He was always telling me to immerse myself you know, into the, the gym culture, into, into what the athletes were doing and not to be shy because the only way you learn is to be able to place yourself in that environment and not to just stand back. So he was always telling me, okay, this is like, you know, an elite triathlete that's here, all right, this is her program, you know, follow her around, you know, get to know her a little bit better. And through, through that, it just made me a little bit more outgoing with um, the different athletes. And the athletes were also, you know, really good because even though you think of that, oh my gosh, you know, they are like Olympic caliber athletes, you know, elite athletes, they are really welcoming. It all comes down to um, just getting that rapport with um, the athlete to get to know them better. That's how, you know, a coach and athlete can progress together in terms of, you know, competitions or trying to improve in terms of their performance. First time ever being able to watch an Olympics, knowing that, hey, I know that person or I've worked with that person before. And it's kind of like you're, you know, along a part of their journey. So yeah, it's just like, you know, nerve wracking, you know, shouting at the scream and then you know, really rooting for them and hoping that they do well because, you know, you're, you pretty much, yeah, you've just been part of the journey with them.